And right now at 6 o'clock, Miami Lakes Mayor Michael Pizzi tangles with a tree and the tree wins. Take a look at the damage done. This is an oak after the mayor crashed into it. Pizzi, known for his love of a television camera, has been downright sheepish today, avoiding cameras and reporters after his crash last night. CBS 4's Gary Nelson tells us Pizzi left the scene of the accident for a while, but was not cited by the police. Flamboyant Miami Lakes Mayor Michael Pizzi is a winner. He beat federal corruption charges. He won reinstatement as mayor, but he lost a round with this oak tree near his home last night. Police were called to a report of a car that had crashed head on into this tree. When cops arrived, no one was in the car. They observed what they thought was fresh blood in the vehicle. Uh, so they did what's called an area canvas. They actually walked around the area trying to look for somebody that may be injured. After a while, Mayor Michael Pizzi returned to the accident scene, said he hit the tree in this four-door black Kia that he leases. He said he'd walk to a nearby friend's home for help with a gash on his forehead. He told cops he swerved to avoid a dark animal, maybe an unlucky black cat, and hit the tree instead. He wasn't asked or required to submit to an alcohol test. Uh, there was no need to. They did not um, have any, um, there was no evidence or signs of impairment of any sort. Uh, just uh, an individual that had uh, suffered a, a uh, minor laceration to his forehead. Even though there were lots of Miami Lakes District cops around, they left lots of wreckage behind, headlamps and the like. Miami-Dade police officers were on this scene for some five and a half hours. Two cops, a sergeant, and a major. A major deal when the mayor plows into a tree and leaves the scene rather than calling 911, but no citation was issued. He went to a seek assistance, came back within a reasonable amount of time. That's why the accident was changed from a hit and run to an actual crash report. And like I said, he was he was very cooperative with the investigators. Pizzi, who has never been known to see a TV camera he didn't like, did not return our repeated messages today. This traffic homicide investigators report concludes the mayor operated his car in a negligent, careless manner. But because no one witnessed the accident, police are not allowed to issue a citation. In Miami Lakes, Gary Nelson, CBS 4 News. Gary, thank you. Well, late this afternoon, Mayor Pizzi released a statement saying, in part, like any other human being, I can have a traffic accident. Thank God no one was injured. I'm happy that all of the police officers found me to be cooperative and respectful. And we're continuing to follow a development.